Hello, everyone. Welcome to a What's on Saturday. Welcome uh, to the weekend. Actually, I have I said that a few times, watching. but I realize that you guys are watching this kind of halfway through the weekend. So not welcome to the weekend. Welcome I to... I hope your weekend is going well. Welcome to Saturday night. It's Saturday night. We should just start doing that. And live some... from New York. Yeah, live from Minnesota. Live from somebody's spare bedroom night. in Minnesota. Yeah, so it's Saturday. It's time for What's on Saturday. But yesterday we did have a second channel fun fall video and yes, Ryan was in it this week. So if you'd like to check that out, the second it was so channel... so I had such a good time. Second channel is always linked below. Also, again, this Saturday, we have a bunch of P.O. Box packages to I'm open up at the end. I'm so excited. None of this them... This is crazy. None of them are trickery, te making us think we have PR, so... No. They're all from you lovely people. I can all tell that they're from the lovely, amazing individuals that watch I can all morning. tell. <laughs> yes. You guys are starting to stress out our post office with the packages, which I love. I, I love that I so much. It's our only post office man is also, like, not nice. <laughs> like, he just is one of those people that's just yeah. got bad attitude. So whenever I show up, I pull the stuff out of the thing. He's like, you got so many in the back. And then he brings out literally this, like, massive stack yeah. of things. We can't help it that we have nice friends. It was like, hmm. <laughs> so I was at your birthday. <laughs> no. So we have eight this time, which actually is the same amount as last time. But last time we hadn't checked for like multiple weeks. This no. time we only haven't checked for a week. So you guys are so sweet and amazing and we don't deserve this at all. But we'll no. do that at the end. We'll get into that oh, at the I'm end. I'm so excited. So if you're interested in that, stay tuned till the end. And we're super pumped. And we're going to jump into What's on Saturday. But before we do, please hit the subscribe button if this is your first time here. And if it's not, please hit the thumbs up. Or if it is, also please hit the thumbs up. Thank you. Now we're going to jump into the sales. This week covers the 2nd through the 8th. And yeah. this week I had one really good sale or else the week was kind of once again like, eh, meh. What was pretty good compared to the week I had last week. Yeah, Circumstances any... have definitely changed. So this was like a little bit more normal. I was able to source on Saturday, Sunday, which was nice. And we are going to the bins again this Sunday, which is that Tuesday video, yes. which is the bins haul. So Hopefully it's good. Tuesday will be a bins haul. And also then we do still want to keep making some like fun fall videos before yeah. we hit Halloween. I know. So please below, let us know what else you'd like to see doesn't have to just keep being bolo lists. Like, yeah. what kind of fun, like, fall reseller stuff do you guys want to see? Please let us know. Anyways, the first day of What's on Saturday is the second, and I had four sales. I had eight. So, my first sale was to Jill. Jill. Jill is so sweet, and she actually makes another appearance this week. She bought this Urban Outfitters gingham ruffle collar, and so she cute. actually bought this for her little chihuahua. She bought it for her dog, and that makes, that's actually, okay, she, was, she was like, that's don't, gonna be adorable. She was like, don't be offended and don't laugh, but it's a cape for my chihuahua, and I was like, that's amazing. I literally can't be a fan of I love that. That's adorable. So I love that Jill. Jill is a big fan of her little dog. And she got that for 35 and I get 28 Then Glamma was so sweet that after <laughs> after What's Old Saturday went up, she was like, I'm going to jumpstart your week. And so she made a purchase for me for full price. She's a sweetheart. I love Glamma. So she bought this vintage 1995 Halloween ghost sleep shirt. And I also threw in a Rolling Stones t-shirt that she was eyeing for her because I love Glamma. She's adorable. This sold for 45 and I get 36 so thank you so much, Glamma. That means a ton. Glamma Mammal. Then I sold this vintage wicker wall hanging basket, and it sold for 20 and I got 16 Very And cool. last, on the second, Gina did the same thing Glamma did. She was like, I'm going to boost the beginning of your week. And she bought this Lululemon Lavender Essential Windbreaker that was such a cute color. And Gina... I appreciate you all the time, but I especially appreciate when you want to, like, give me a little pick-me-up. That's so sweet. Thanks, Gina. So That's she so got sweet. this for 46 and I get 36 80 So thank you so much, Glamma and Gina. Okay, my first on the second was this vintage Mexican embroidered beaded bohemian backpack. Sold for $35. I made 28 Then I sold this Worth New York purple flared sleeve beaded sweater. Worth is definitely 99.9% .9 of the time. It goes with the real real. Because it's one of those, like, luxury... It's kind of like St. John. Expensive. Not many people want to wear it. I think this was newer and it was really cute. Sold for $50. $50. Whoa, I can't talk today. I made 40 So Worth is an interesting one. Um, it's like really, really expensive. It's really weird. But it's re resale value is not great. No. And they don't really use like super high quality, like high end fabrics. It's Usually expensive. the stuff can feel nice, 
but it's like polyester. Like it's nothing. It's not like silks or wools. no. It's not like St. John because St. John actually uses like wools and all the nice things. Yes, worth counting. Yeah. And I will say, I'm pretty certain that 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 old Worth label where it's like a double W, like it's a weird W. That's not the same Worth. If it says Worth New York, that's the expensive one. So I don't know what the other one is. It's, it's really like old, old. JC Penney's good. But it's different. But I was very excited to get fifty dollars for that sweater. And then Anna bought this really amazing fossil cream foldover leather satchel. I love selling these fossil bags. They always do really good for me. This one sold for $50 and I made $40. So Anna, thank you. Then I sold this Free People Off the Shoulder Gray Long Sleeve Top. Sold for $30. I made it $24. Then I sold this Mayball Tiered Sleeve Creme Wool Sweater. Creme. Sold for $28. I made $22.40. Then I sold this pair of Fry Gray Brown Leather Studded. These were the Billy Low, like Billy Short Boot, I think is the tech, the technical name. Um, these were in the haul on the shoes. Yes. yes. These sold real fast. Uh, sold for $100. I made 80 <laughs> I definitely could have gotten more, but she countered my offer within like 15 minutes with them being listed. And I was like, we'll just make all that money back off of one pair of shoes. That's okay. I don't know why. I just had a flashback of that one time. Remember when I went and Ooh. bought some McDonald's fries because I had found fries that day and it was a Friday. So I put that much effort into taking an Instagram picture and I was like, happy Friday. And I had fries, fries. And it was Friday. Do you remember that? That just makes me want McDonald's. <laughs> And I, I don't know because why it's not good for you, but like, oh, I don't know why. Double cheeseburger. I've like never fries. thought of that picture again until you. <laughs> I don't. I don't know why. And then Miss Gina came over to my closet and got this really nice Patagonia blue quarter zip long sleeve. Sold for forty five dollars. I made thirty six. Thank you, Gina. Gina. She is so sweet. What a cutie pie. Gina's pillow is looking at us right now, staring at us. The queen herself. I Mrs. love this. Mrs. Tipsy Lantern. Um, she's she's a pumpkin. I know. Jack o' lantern. Oh. Tipsy lantern. Then I sold this Lululemon set of four cool racerback tank tops, like I said in the haul, which I think the clothing was on Thursday. Um, I locked them all up and I saw them together and they weigh nothing in the bins and they sell really, really, really fast. This sold mm -hmm. the same day that I listed them. $40 minus a shipping discount and made $29.54. I think I listed them at 50, which is always my goal with like when I have lots of stuff is I list them a little too high and then I send that offer of like, oh, right in the middle. Yeah. Ryan's lucky. He always like seems to find like a pile of Lulu. It's, it's always never just there's one. never one. For me, the it's Lulu just people one. there's never just one. For me, it is but unless for it's Ryan, from Goodwill. It's a heap. <laughs> literally. Okay, and that was it on my second. On the third, I only had one sale. I had four. So my one sale, it was a good sale though, and it was one that was good enough where if I didn't have another sale that day, I was totally content with that. Mm -hmm. It was this amazing, amazing pair of Sal McCartney blue corduroy utility pants. I loved these, and I wouldn't have been mad if I had to keep them. They sold for $180, and I get $144, and she loved them, so I'm happy to hear that. I love Sal McCartney. Me too. Then, so this is a men's bolo, but it's definitely like a bread and butter bolo. It is carbon to cobalt, and it's an expensive men's like newer like work you know not work not uniform but like um like business casual stuff and like some of the comps like the pants and the blazers were like 35 to 50 dollars the button downs an easy 20 bucks this one sold for 20 dollars i made 16 and it was a bins find then i sold this pair of new without tag discos black textured leather clogs i really wanted to keep these for myself but they were just a size too big <laughs> i have been in the market for a pair of clogs and i love these but they were a little too big these went to Kara. So Kara, I hope you enjoy your... Carrie. I can't read my own handwriting. Carrie, I'm so sorry. He's meant to carry. She got it for $45. I made 36 I can't read his handwriting either. What do we think well, that He might have still got it wrong. So... No, C-A-R-E-Y. Carrie. Okay. Carrie, we Carrie, apologize. my deepest apologies. Mr... I almost said Mr. Jones can't write well. Wolf. I can't write well. I apologize. Next on the third, Zara Fuzzy Cream Lantern Sleeve Sweater. It sold for $30. I made $24. Then I sold this rare Lulu Lemon Bleach Dyed Gray Swiftly Tank Top. The Swiftly Tank Tops are one of the Lulu pieces. Top tier. They sell every single time I list them. This one sold for $34 for a tank top. Minus a shipping discount, I made $24.74. I think I listed it at $40, which is always like, like I was saying with the tank top, the lot of the tank tops list really high. So that nice little offer. So the fourth was my most sales in the day, and I did have five sales. I had four. 
So my first sale went to Emily. So thank you so much, Emily. She had some patience because like I said, in the Thursday haul, it kind of took me a while to list all those shoes because we had a busy week. So she was interested in this vintage plaid button thermal waffle shacket. And she was waiting for me to list this treasure and bond croc embossed pair of Chelsea boots. And so those once I listed them, I sent her an offer of 65, I believe. And I get $51.94, so thank you so much, Emily. When cute I was packaging outfit. them up, I was like, oh, this Ooh. is like a really cute Oh, this outfit. is nice. I love that. So thank you, Emily. Then I sold this Anthropology Katrina Lucci canvas bag. Katarina. This is an expensive anthro bag brand. It sold for 100 and I get 80 Ooh. Then I sold probably my lowest sale price <laughs> I've ever done. But I was about to consign this, so I was like, I will take legitimately anything vineyard vines linen button gingham top i don't really like to sell vineyard anymore it's like libby pulitzer i personally cannot sell either of them at all no sold for 11 and i get 805 ah what a big high dollar sale. then for my own mm. personal collection i feel like it's a long time since i've said that mm -hmm. but these originals cactus long sleeve tea sold for 30 and i get 24 it was very cute and then my best sale of the week Big ended sale. the Big fourth. Sale. I was in the storage unit literally moving this item. Like it was in my hand when the notification the popped up that I got an offer on this Burberry Irish Tweed belted trench coat. And that offer was a whopping $525. Now, of course, this coat probably retailed for like $4,000 in its day. It's expensive. So I will be getting 420 once it leaves the Poshmark headquarters. So that was a great The sell. Poshmark HQ. Okay, my first on the fourth. Unif Black White Striped Chunky the Clarissa Sweater. Sold for $55. I made 44 Then I sold this Denim & Supply Blue Floral, Blue Floral Tie Neck Top. Sold for 25 I made 20 then I sold this new tag Draper James blue floral smock dress, which this was a bin find. I love Draper James, and I feel like I never find it. That's exactly so I was really right pumped now. to find. Yeah, I was gonna say you saw that one last week. No, I, was, I bought one last week. Yes, you did. I was super excited to find one of the bins and new tags. Sold for sixty dollars. I made forty eight, and that is it for my fourth. Then on the fifth, I had three. I had one. My first sale was a very fitting, spooky, ooky, cookie sale. Ookie. And Ookie. I cannot believe how long these took to sell. They had tons of likes, but I also can believe how long they took. And I'll explain that in a second. It's Torrid Gothic Mystical Psychic Moon Witchy Leggings. You gotta throw all those keywords in there. <laughs> Not that we can do the long titles. All <laughs> yeah. the keywords. I, I didn't have witchy core though, because I listed these before I started using that. I should have added it. So these sold for 28 and I get 1994. The issue with these these is they were a torrid double zero and like we always say Just torrid medium. zeros and torrid double zeros never really sell that well because that's like even not plus size even when it's something so cute and amazing like this mm -hmm. i knew these would at some point sell just because like they're so amazing yeah. but they took forever so i'm glad they finally sold and i hope they have an amazing new home yes. then another ooky spooky kooky sale i sold this pair of tommy bahama halloween glow in the dark skull Doesn't sneakers have a pair of these too? my mother rocks a pair yes, of these she does. um these sold for 42 and i get 33 60 and last was another fitting for the season mm -hmm. urban outfitters vintage wrangler black dad jeans and these sold for 40 dollars, and i get 32. my one on the fifth went to jessica thank you so much jessica super cute bundle levi's altered 721 stone washed gray high-rise jeans these were adorable then she got the um others follow that really cute striped mm. sweater from the Thursday haul, and then she got this new tag free people black tie front ribbed little bodysuit bundle sold for a hundred dollars. I made 80, so thank you, Miss Jessica. Then on the sixth, I had two sales, I had two as well. My first sale was this pair of torrid camo print skinny jeans, and these sold for 35 and gave me a 25.54 again. They were kind of a smaller size for Torrid, mm -hmm. so they took a little bit or else I would expect those to sell very quickly. Then Jill popped her beautiful little head back into my closet. Well, Miss Jill. And she purchased these La Artiste Flourish Black sp Sprinted, printed strappy sandals and this amazing. If I had a cabin, I'd be keeping this. Honestly, if I had my own home, I would have been keeping this. <laughs> it is really cute. Vintage cabin woods print 
needlepoint throw pillow. Oh my gosh, the print on this was just like amazing. It sold, together these sold for 75 and I get 60, so I'm glad that I know that pillow is going to a good home. Yes, Jill will love on that uh, pillow. My first on the sixth was a another Lululemon item. These were the black blissed out cropped culottes. These sold for $42. I made $33.60. And then my last on the 6th, oh nope, I had three. So my second on the 6th was this Free People Black Ribbed Long Sleeve Tunic Top. Sold for $28. I made it $22.40. Then I sold this Peach Crew Neck Short Sleeve Motivational T-shirt. This went to, or so her username is Fried Shrimp. And I did my research and I went to your Instagram and your Instagram's also Fried Shrimp. I cannot find your real name. <laughs> Super sweet. So sent me a little Brad DM. Shirt. Was like, I need that t-shirt. And it was like, girl, send me a $10 offer. So I gave it to her for 10 bucks. I make seven oh five. She gets a happy little t-shirt. I make $7. Everybody wins. You made a bunch of fried shrimp. Very happy. Yes, I did. Yes, so I did. then on the 7th, I only had one sale. Me too. My one sale was this... Okay, this is weird. This John Galt plaid Valentina pants. I did not know that these sold until today. We were in the storage unit, like, uh, pulling. Pulling, pulling, the, pulling inventory. And I was like, oh... That's sold. Okay. So, sold for 24. I get 19. Brandy 20. Mobile. I never sold Brandy Mobile. So, of course, my they were like teeny that tiny. White. Yeah. My first and only on the seventh was this a Berger Madeline Brown lace bralette. She was over the moon happy when I took her offer, which I thought was hysterical. <laughs> um, sold for 25 bucks. I made 20. This was a Vince find. It literally was lace and two elastic straps. It was a penny. So, like, they paid me to take it, Except honestly. Our bins went up in price. Went from uh, $1.49 to $1.69. Rude. I see you Goodwill Easter Seals. It's funny, because mm. then that night, after I realized the price had went up, I had a dream that people were, like, boycotting. I mean, I'll go. Like, Y'all can boycott. I'm gonna go. <laughs> then on the 8th, I only had two sales. I only had two as well. So my first sale was this Anthropology Featherbone Embroidered Blouse. This is... Uh, one of my favorite anthro pieces ever and mm -hmm. it used to sell for like 60 now I only sold it for 25 unfortunately and I will be getting 20 and my last sale was this pair of Madewell block heel Rory booties These sold a lot faster than I expected and they sold for 32 and I get 25 at 60 My first on the 8th was this pair of Dansko black leather strappy ankle and this also went to one of you guys, but I forgot to write your name down because I'm an awful human being. I'm so sorry. So I hope you enjoy your new lovely little dance go sandals. They sold for $34 and I made it $24.74. And then my last on the 8th was also something that was in the end of the thrift with me. It was the Hulk Hogan Hollywood Graphic T-shirt. Also, side note, thank you to everybody that helped me with that other wrestler. He's a wrestler. Diamond Dallas or Blue whatever. Diamond Blue. Dallas something from Texas. I don't know. Uh, Vintage Hulk Hogan Hollywood t-shirt circa 2002, listed at 70, got a $45 offer, took it because I paid $3 for it. Uh, I make $36. So my gross for the week was 1361 thanks to the Burberry sale. Mine was $927. And my net was $1,088.80. Mine was $734.22. Yeah, so overall... Kind of a meh week, not Good. terrible, not terrible. Very baseline, yeah. which is nice. Which is exactly what baseline you said that you wanted nice. last week. Yes, I just needed a regular average, nothing too crazy. I'll take know. a crazy week. I would love a crazy week, <laughs> but you know what? Yeah, better than last week. If I get sure. normal, normal is better so, than So thank you guys that popped into our closet to help us out because of our not so great week last week. We really appreciate it. Appreciate it. And thank you to everyone that has filled our room with boxes again. Oh, we can open packages Before now. we jump into that, let us know below how your sales week was. We always like to hear if you guys had a yes. really good one, if it was more like ours, how did it go? Anything but, exciting you sold. But, 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 it's time for hopefully another... It's time for presents, as Debbie calls them. Spooky Christmas. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> We're going to start with the Polly Miller ones. We have three... Don't show addresses. Three Polly Miller. How about ones. I just do that? And this is from Shannon. <gasps> Shannon. I'm so excited. Shannon is amazing. I'm She's sure so we have sweet. all heard her name in like literally every What's Up Saturday. All the we love her so much. She's so adorable. as always, we will Look start hard. with a card, and it's Jack Ryan, to Mike. Jack Ryan and Mike. So unfortunately, Mike is running around outside with Debbie because she's mowing. How fun is this card? Oh my gosh, this, this is, is a very Debbie card. Debbie loves pineapples. Like she has pineapple print everything. So. Literally. And it has that. Woo. Oh, this is going to okay, be Okay, so apparently there are treats for Mike in this package that are guaranteed to turn Mike into a celebrated tap dancer. 
I hope so. Can you imagine? But also, that's very fitting. Oh my gosh, me. which also, Shannon, it's so funny because we just ran out of dog treats yesterday. So this is like They literally so could not fitting. have come at a better time. So, oh my gosh. Okay. So I guess I'll show the treats first. Oh my gosh. These dazzling beef recipe cuts will make your dog oh, a celebrated tap that. dancer. Of course, they may lose their rhythm after their belly is full from snacking. That's I will so give cute. him one of these at the end of the video after we're done with the packages. And he's going to start tap dancing, I guess. Mike, so is, you thank better you start so tap dancing, Shannon. Shannon. I'm going to hold you to them. Oh, my gosh. Also, she oh sent God, us two amazing. stickers. One says, I survived, survived the, the bins. bins. And That's the, nice. The other says, death before retail price, which is That's very so accurate. I don't even know the last I time I paid I love retail. these. Shannon, these are so nice. Thank you, Shannon. Thank you for everything you do, Shannon. You are like the sweetest Shannon, person Shannon, do be a little fairy godmother. Ever. I, I love, love it. Now I'm going to open one from Patricia. 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 It's Patricia okay. <gasps> oh, I know exactly what Wait, this is. Was Patricia the one that sent Did the other John Did she send us the cat last week, Patricia? Maybe. Okay, Similar so what is this? So this oh, Creepy cro- Oh, it's a table runner. I know what this is. Like I said, Shannon, I was- Shannon, Patricia, you don't know how much I'm excited to tablescape for Halloween. Halloween and set out all the spooky things and take all the cute little Pinterest pictures of all my spooky things on my lovely black oak table. These John Darian pieces are so they hard are also to find, everybody. Beautiful. Oh, look at this. It's bad. It's freaking bad. It's freaking bad. I love I Halloween. Halloween. It matches my new tattoo. Which, which is adorable. Allie reminded me I haven't said anything about. We did get but new yes, tattoos. I got a new Halloween tattoo. I got a dragonfly. <laughs> But oh my god! I'm sorry, I got a bat. This See, is adorable. How could you not be obsessed with like his art? This print is amazing. But also, this just isn't gonna stay around during Halloween, Miss Patricia. This is going to be an all year because it's green Absolutely. for spring. Absolutely. It has snakes for summer. It has freaking bats for Frogs fall. Frogs are kind of springy. And it's just winter. Cute. This is amazing. <gasps> Patricia, oh that is gosh. so nice of you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Patricia. Literally, I'm so obsessed with this I collection. I love this. Any I piece can't I wait. can get from it. Huh. So we have so much like Halloween dishes and like glassware. Oh. So like the tablescape. It's literally gonna fit right in. Like that's that is amazing. going to be so cute. Next up okay. is from Janelle. And oh. Janelle is from California. So there is a card. Okay, so good. So Janelle, we will open this for I love the bubble. Oh, there's probably more for Jack Mike. Jack and Mike, cute. Mike's gonna be having a blast. Mike is gonna have a field day with these He's trees. gonna have a full belly and he's gonna not be able to tap dance. <laughs> Oh. We got cute little pictures of the puppy and the family. These are so sweet and cute. Look at so Look cute. at how happy that dog also, is. Also, they said that their little cute family watches our main channel and second channel. And that's, that's so, so nice. sweet. We Thanks, love guys. all of you. Also, it's Janelle's birthday. At least sometime soon. Because she said for her birthday she'd like to give gifts. And so that's why she sent it this. So, like, happy birthday, Janelle. Happy birthday, Janelle. Everyone, please go check out Janelle's username. It is Janelle G17. So I will, hopefully editing Jack is putting that on the screen right now. So Thank you, Miss Janelle. Oh, I'm so excited. So let's for Mike. <gasps> the Jason dog toy. I it's love hysterical. this. I think I've seen these at like Spirit of Halloween and I really wanted to buy one. Does and also, squeak? like I said. Or does he have that crinkle? Mike loves, Mike loves, the, he loves the crinkle. loves so crinkle. That is adorable. Like I said oh a couple God. videos back, I have still not seen Friday the 13th. And that's like on my bucket no, list for this Halloween either. season. It's like the one horror movie I haven't seen. Now yes. I really have to. Mike can sit next that to me and watch hysterical. it with his little plushie. With his little dude. This is for Ryan. <gasps> Oh, how oh, that's pretty! So cute. I love that color. Okay, so I'm not ever. It gonna also take... goes with your outfit. I'm really literally well. not ever gonna take this off. Oh my Fun gosh, fact. I love that green color. Oh, look at how pretty! That's so cute. It <gasps> matches all the ones that you have. Too. I know. My other one, my tree branch was starting to poke me, so that didn't make it. Oh, how nice, Janelle. Janelle and fam. Janelle and company. That's adorable. And then Thank this you. is for. She's so sweet. They sent us literally each like our own gift. Oh my gosh, that's so sweet. <sighs> Oh my gosh, that's so Janelle. cool. Also, Ryan and I are probably going to share it because I Ryan know, loves I just gonna say, it. I know this is for Jack, but I'm 100% going to take this when I go to This DC. is so cool. Oh my god, that's amazing. <gasps> I've been wanting every year 
I like debate, should I order one of those like custom Halloween Starbucks cups? And I never have, because they're like all over Etsy and I think they're all over Posh at this point. Yeah, they kind of are. And I never These have. These are amazing. And now I don't have to. I love this. Thanks to now. That is so cute. It is like spooky Christmas. One of the boxes. This one is from Wanda. Miss Wanda. Where's Wanda from? I always like to know what state. North Wanda North is from North Carolina. North Carolina. North Carolina. Card first. We have a letter. Oh, I love the font. It's I Halloween love the font, font Miss Wanda. This Definitely is something love. that Wanda has had for a few years, and since we love Halloween, she knows we'll take good care of it. She's all packaged up for the safe journey from North Carolina also, to the cold, keep, harsh winters of Minnesota. Keeping our pile of cards because we always keep. Oh, all I always our cards. keep. I need to get a bigger binder for the we cards. We have a drawer That's on my to-do list. Is I need to put them in like a binder. We have a drawer for cards. <gasps> Oh, look at how cute oh she is, gosh. little Miss Halloween Betty Boop. Look I at her. I love that. Oh, that is precious. That's so cute. I love, I'm unfortunately not like versed in the Betty Boop world. 1999. Who is this cat dude? I unfortunately so don't know, cute. but I love him. That is adorable. Oh, oh Wanda. Wanda. We will absolutely take amazing care of the this. The best care for Miss Betty. This is so, that is cute. so cute. Once again, a forever decoration. We oh, will have literally. this in our house forever. She's going in the Halloween China hut. Are I you kidding me? This and the cute little goose. I, I love, love that. that. Wanda. That's, thank you so much, Wanda. That is adorable. We I will, love how all the bags have little like jack o' lanterns on them too. We will take That's amazing so care of her. Oh, you know she's gonna Absolutely. be cleaned, dusted. I'm glad she showed up perfectly fine. So the next one is like a double. Mm -hmm. So it's two boxes, but they're from. Am I okay? I was like, am I showing the address? They're from no. the same address. One just has my name, and one has both of ours. They're from Texas, and the name says Downs. So I don't know if that's maybe a, there's a first name. A last okay. Well, the card mm -hmm. might clarify. It. Open package completely before reading the card. Also, I will say this <laughs> little package open ASAP. <laughs> says open ASAP and open before Halloween. So okay, we can do that. I'm already. I'm we can do that. I'm all in. I'm so pumped. I love the multicolor. I know, the tissue paper tissue is paper. so cute. You got a candle. This one the candle. candle. Whoa. What is that? <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, this is like, this is like, uh, um, is it 3D printed? printed? Oh my god, it is. Oh my. That is so fun. Gosh. Okay, wait. Look at how realistic Whoa. this looks. That is so cool. <gasps> the teeth are so deep. Oh my. This is like an actual, like. This is so cool. This is like almost like a medical, like 3D printed, like. That's insane. That's so <gasps> fun. <laughs> I wonder oh my if it's supposed gosh. to go under. It could, put it... yeah. And then you could put like a full size yeah. candle. Oh. oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Downs. Need to read can't... the card because like. Can we put heat on this is my question. Because this feels like plastic and I'd hate to put well, a candle on it and it melts. Probably not when it's like about to be completely burned out or burned down. But oh my gosh, it's just like insane. Yes, okay. hopefully we have like care we instructions. Because God forbid I ruin this. That would be awful. We love the Halloween. Oh, I hope it makes a noise. Oh, there's a letter. Oh, there's like a Halloween card. Oh my gosh, I love it. There's a little eye. Here is the card. Okay, so Deborah we got some clarification. Get there together. <laughs> so this is from Deborah. So it thank you so it. much, Deborah. This is amazing. This is a 3D printed skull that her friend once made, like one of for their relative. Yeah. And she was like, "You she was gotta make another to be one." Like quantity two. So Deborah's that is look, so sweet. Deborah's looking out for that me. That is so fun. Also, Ryan was right. You put the little light down here, so it goes through like the teeth and stuff, and then you put like we a can put a candle. candle on top because I would literally cry if I heard this poor thing. This is, so, this is so That is so detailed? fun. It's oh my crazy. gosh, I'm so excited. Also, oh. Deborah's second box is for Ryan and she said they probably won't get there at the same time, but Plot twist, they did. What Deborah? Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. They did. I was like somebody sent me a computer. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, that's so cute. It's a pug. And it's a watercolor pug. That's adorable. That is so fun, Deborah. That is so nice. I we have that. so many 
pug hamsters in the house. Well, this Debbie is going does. to make a so lovely now, little addition. Debbie does. And so now, now we, we have will one. have one, too. Oh, I love That's it. That's so, so cute. cute. Found this picture at our local SPCA fundraiser and thought of you. I hope you like it. Oh, Deborah, I do you, like Deborah. it. Thank you. Also, Deborah said that her favorite time of year is right now as well. I vibe with Deborah. That's She's amazing. going to fit very well in this little Thank household. Thank you so much, Oh, Deborah, Deborah. that is so sweet. Thank I you. literally love that skull so much. The that, canvas is so cute. That I love be, it. That will be in my office. That is going to go in my classroom when I go to classroom, Miss Deborah. The next one, yes, is from Canada and it says fragile all over it. I hope it's more ketchup chips. And it's from Hermione's Vines. Ooh! A fun so name. Beautiful yeah. handwriting, first off. Also, this Carolyn. is from Carolyn. Carolyn. And what her username name. is Hermione's Vines. Look at how beautiful yeah, that literally. handwriting is. Also, Carolyn. I love this pen color. I know, that purple. beautiful little purple pen. Okay. Okay. So, all the way from Canada. She said one of them is very Jack centric. I already know. And what I it think is. I know which one it is because that's hysterical. I freaking love this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So, we actually, if you guys see <laughs> the second channel, we Rage. got one of these last year. We used it to make cookies. But Debbie and Joe were like, so, which Joe's right. my dad, if I have not made that clear. They were so jealous of it. That we and had a little they wanted one. one. So they can have the old one, and I am totally going to keep this one. So thank you so much, Carolyn. Carolyn. This is so cool. I love this so That's much. so sweet. And then she also sent, oh my gosh, we get to make something. Oh, with it. Lord, Carolyn. Pumpkin this sounds good. Pancake and waffle mix. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that How sounds good. delicious. Oh, Lord. <gasps> Along with, oh. It looks like jam. Carolyn is trying to get me to gain some weight. That's okay. It's the Maple holidays. Maple <laughs> pumpkin butter. Carolyn. This might have to be one of the, like, second oh, channel videos. Oh, Lord. Oh, these are gonna. Carolyn, you speaking to us? Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. And we can make them skulls. We can make them in those skulls. I'm so yeah. excited. And Carolyn, thank you so so much. I'm so excited to try I these. cannot wait. I'm literally salivating. That makes me so hungry. <laughs> oh my gosh. We have not I eaten yet wait. today. And I no, literally we have wish, not had lunch. I wish these were already cooked and I could just... Pop yeah. one in there. This is from Miss Catherine. Thank you, Miss Catherine. And this is also fragile, it says. Yes, there so. is fragile. Okay, card first up. She sent me a sucks. sympathy card and I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, on that note, thank you, Catherine. That was That's very so nice. Sweet. That was so genuine. Oh, this is from Cat Cram. She got me. Cat Cram. She, we know she her really from Instagram. She's always so sweet. Oh my, she's gonna oh. make me cry. She's Stop literally. It. Her so so she sent sweet. us really nice wedding napkins. That's also gonna make me cry. <laughs> to my favorite young men, some Halloween and some wedding things. I love cat cram. So she sent us three adorable packs of wedding napkins. They say eat, drink, and be married. <laughs> love, laughter, and happy ever after. And then best day ever. Oh my god. And then she sent us a $25 Visa gift card. Which we will use for the wedding in some oh, way. We saved them. She has yes, sent we us, have yeah, not used them. She has sent us like a couple of these in the past and we have them securely we still got saved. Them. And we're going to use them. We got we them with all of our wedding stuff. wedding stuff. Okay. Oh, this looks She fun. is too sweet. Aww. <laughs> oh, I like it. Oh, look at how fun this little mug is. It's a bunch of skeletons out for coffee. They're just like having that's a little amazing. coffee. Oh, that's so cute. A Ray Dunn mug, and it says, groomed to be. Oh. oh, that's so cute. Okay. I've never even seen this one before. I haven't either. So it's like a, oh, it is. These are so sweet. Cat, She's that like is the most adorable. thoughtful person ever. More Thank prepared you. for our wedding than we are. Literally. <laughs> that is so nice. This is so sweet. Thank you so much, Kat. She's always, like, everything she says, everything thing she does she's like the she's so sweetest nice. i love her so much thank I you so much cat one that more. was an emotional roller coaster cat this is all about an emotional roller coaster cat you really did me i try not to read sympathy cards on camera because i actually cry so this is from Anne in illinois Anne in illinois it's an orange envelope so i'm <gasps> excited it might be a halloween card and it is did you eat my donut no <laughs> Oh, Anne wrote a That's really so sweet. sweet card. I'm so excited to see what's in here. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh this was the for little Ryan. beanie kitty. <gasps> Earrings. Okay, so neither of us have our ear pierced. Okay, but now pierced. I need to go get them pierced. No. <laughs> so we will give these. These to are going Debbie. to Debbie. She's mm -hmm. gonna love these. Also, she's gonna flip. when I tell her that someone sent her something, she's going to like. She's scream. gonna be so excited. And that the cat, so she said the cat Aww. was for Ryan. The cat. I'm going to put that in my costume too. And let's What's his see. name? <gasps> oh. 
we got like the whole sweet Ray Dunn collection now for like our wedding. Oh, nice. These are Those so are adorable. cute. She said these are for our future house, which I'm These are only going to be decorative because I don't want to get food on these. They're so I know. nice. And then we have one more thing from Anne. Let's see. She also said she was going to send me the ghost beanie, but someone <laughs> slash Nifty Thrifty Mommy, Nifty Thrifty AZ. Aaron beat, beat her to it. it. But that's okay. That's really funny. We got room for a few. This is very well wrapped. Good job, Anne. <laughs> Everything arrived in one piece, which is always what we can hope for, isn't it? Is it soap dispenser? Yes. Yes. Oh, how cute oh, is that? Oh, I love this. I this is cute. Oh, I love that. Love this. I have a ghost one. Little spooky soap dispenser. So I'll have one for the bathroom and one and for the, the kitchen. And then the guest bathroom. Oh my gosh. That is adorable. I love this. Oh, Anne. Thank you so much, Anne. And That's again, so nice. as always, thank you, thank you everybody. everybody that sent us something. Literally. Never feel pressure to send Once anything. again, we don't deserve any of it. We don't deserve any of you. No. So thank you guys so much. This is so sweet. It was like spooky Christmas again, which is like my favorite thing ever. Thank you guys all so much. We love literally all of you so much. Even if you've never sent us anything. We love you just as much. We love That's you okay. too. So thank you all so much for not only sending us this amazing sweet stuff, but thank you so much for watching. We appreciate that. And everybody that purchased from me this week yes. as well. Thank you. We're so lucky to have you guys. And we will see you guys on Tuesday with a haul. So fingers crossed that it's good. I hope so. And we will see you guys then. We'll end on a yawn. <sighs> Bye. What better way to end a video? Mike is very excited about his new items. And also Debbie's dog Misty is here too. Misty, this is not for you. Okay, well, she's a bully. Mike is ready to become a tap dancer. So I have to be fair and <laughs> give them each one, so we're gonna have two tap dancers. Ow! Okay, so she really liked that, I guess. And then Mike is so sweet. Oh, Mike, do you like it? Is that a yes? Mike, do you like it? Did you, did you like the treat, Mike? Yes. <laughs>